Check it out. Dr. Mario versus Dr. Mario World. Does this blow your mind or what? So Dr. Mario versus Dr. Mario World. Here we've got our classic Game Boy, the very first Nintendo Game Boy ever released with Dr. Mario versus the iPhone running the new Dr. Mario World. So let's just have a look at each of the two. We're going to show you the difference in the quality, in the colors, and in the gameplay. Very, very exciting review today. So let's just put this one down. We're just gonna leave that right there. Here it is, one player. So you can choose your virus level. How strong do you want these things to be? All the way up to 20, right? I can select the speed where I want them to be low, medium, or high speed. We're gonna select low because we are an amateur. Music, fever, chill, and off. Fever, I think, is what we're familiar with, with the newer version. So here we go. Let's get onto it. All right, so it's not three in this one. You gotta do more than three. We're not doing too good here. Oh, and we've died. Now the great thing about this, you've got your score on the top right corner. You've got little Mario there throwing you the uh, the pills. You've got the level and the virus, and of course this will just speed up as we go on. So the hard thing is that it's actually really hard to uh, see what's going on on this Game Boy screen. The, the quality is just out of this world. Out of this world good. Or I can't even see what is going on. I think we're nearly there. There we go, clear, push start. Great, I've passed level one and level two. There you go. We'll just leave you there, folks. The incredible quality of the Game Boy. Dr. Mario versus the iPhone. I think uh, the quality is comparable. And what's interesting is it's reversed. The pills go that way, while on the Game Boy they go that way. So music is also slower, if you've noticed that. And, whoa, look at that. How is that? That was just too easy. Cleared it, three stars. I'm not too upset with that one. Let's go for level two. Now the other difference is of course you only need to get three as opposed to four. The old version used to get, you have to get four lined up to clear it. And once one's been destroyed, I can move the other side of that pill to somewhere else. Couldn't do that in the old version. So they've definitely made substantial improvements to that game. Very impressed. There you go, that is level two complete. Nice. All right, let's get them both together side by side and just do a good compare there. Oh, I can't actually control them both at once. It's really hard to control both at once. And the music is too stereo-ish. Oh, what's gonna happen here? Wow. I'm getting there. Oh, I forgot, I forgot about my iPhone version. I was just playing the Game Boy one because the Game Boy one doesn't give me an option. It just, the, the pills just get spat out automatically. And Mario is actually making it more difficult in the Game Boy version. The iPhone version, Mario is there to help. And he gives little bonuses. 
you know, to help you out from time to time. It doesn't help you out in the other one. Oh, no, we're going to die. Oh, see, the thing is, I can't, I, I can't use this version. Oh, here we go. We're dead. Missed it. The iPhone version, I can actually use both with, uh, I can use my single finger well, on this one. It's really hard to do this on the Game Boy. There you go. There's a size difference between the two. Brilliant. I hope you enjoyed my little Dr. Mario comparison. Old versus new.